everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I've got a wedding card for you today. I used some uh, frost shimmer spray on a piece of 80 pound Nina uh, Solar White and I'm going to use this uh, oval ornate frame from Pink Fresh Studios and it's uh, they're part of their essentials line and I will cut one frame out of that and then I'll cut a frame out of a couple of more pieces of um, white uh, cardstock to back that with to make it a little bit more substantial on the front of the card. And for my other paper, I am using some Tonic Craft Perfect paper in the Damask, uh, Silver Damask, I believe is what it is. And then I will also be using a couple of dies from Tonic Studios, Wedding Day and Bride and Groom. So that's uh, it for our supplies today, except for the, the stamp set that I use on the inside of this card um, is a Honey Bee stamp, uh, stamp set called Happiness that I think is retired. But it was my only stamp set that had the word wedding in it. And so uh, it's such a shame they retired this one. This was such a great stamp set. I, I used it a lot for birthday cards because I just love the happy um, stamp on it. And it's fabulous. And then uh, to stamp that, I used a Delicata Silver Ink. So just keeping with the silver, silver glittery feel. And uh, that silver um, glitter paper that I cut the wedding day out of and the bride and groom is some Simon Says Stamp glitter paper. I got a bundle, their holiday bundle, which comes with a silver, gold, red, and green, I think think yeah so um just was did this kind of simply I, I just really wanted this really pretty paper from tonic to speak for itself on the front of this card so it's a it's a very clean and simple card um which usually i i like to go overboard and add way more stuff to it but i decided to keep it clean and simple and really let this paper shine through the tonic papers are just so pretty. Um, if you've never looked into their line of uh, specialty papers, it it is something. Um, there is something for every occasion. You know, uh, there's these beautiful ones that look great for weddings. There's uh, some really pretty fall ones. Um, so I'll be breaking those out soon. So uh, back to the card for a second. Here I am peeling out all the uh, stamps that I want to use, except for I forgot one. And I didn't realize that I forgot one until I had it all stamped on there. And I realized that it didn't make any sense because I was missing the word years. So um then I, so I was like, oh, well, I still have more of this uh, shimmer paper that, you know, I, that paper that I sprayed with the shimmer that I cut the ornate frame out of. And so I'm like, oh, I'll just, you know, stamp it again and then put this over it and then it'll bring some more shimmer to the inside and it'll look good. And then I stamped it crooked. So... So then I had to go and get another piece of paper and spray some more paper, make some more shimmer paper and start all over again. So yeah, that, that was fun. But uh, anyway, so I left some of those boo-boos in here. So just so all you new card makers know that everybody makes boo-boos, all these perfect videos that you see online and stuff. You know that they, they edit out all the, all their boo boos, and so I I try to leave some of mine in there just so you know that he's perfect, and we all make mistakes. And um, I think there's where I discovered that yeah, <laughs> the word years is gone. <laughs> anyway, so it's it's been a minute since I've done a regular video, and I've got so many that I want to do. I I've just I've got all this new product that I just want to play with and I, I've just got to find some time and uh, I will we, we've had a house guest for a little while um, uh, some dear friends of ours came down with the COVID and his 94 year old mother lived with them and so when they called us and said that they had come down with the COVID uh, we said we'll take mom you know send her over here 
and we'll take care of her. They, they're always very cautious about, you know, uh, you know, being too much into her six foot space, you know, so uh, luckily that they did not pass it on to her. We've had her for tomorrow will be three weeks and she's fine. So we're all very happy about that. And our friends are doing much, much better. Matter of fact, they uh, were going to call their doctor today and see if they could get a test and uh, see if possibly they could come back, came back negative so they could uh, bring mom home this week. So, um, me, and then, uh, we've got the wedding coming up that we, I made this card for. Um, so on the 19th on the 19th we'll be headed down to New Bronzeville area for um, my my husband's younger brother is getting remarried and then we will come back from there and then head out to Kentucky to take Layton to school so busy times right now but when we get back from Kentucky I'm looking forward to um, getting a lot of crafting done so maybe towards the end of September you'll see more videos from me other than uh, stamp timber or um, haul videos or you know things like that um, and yeah I won't, won't be able to do the stamp timber videos while I'm uh, traveling either so I encourage everybody to uh, to watch out uh, for those daily releases because they release some really pretty stuff okay so back to this card now I finally got it all stamped straight and how I want it and everything and so I'm just adhering that to the inside and then I took a, a little cut of the um, that pretty paper and made an envelope with it. So that's it for today. Um, hopefully we'll see you soon in the next video. Bye. Mm -hmm.